Who knows why Marvel screwed up Secret Invasion? Shadow knows. Shadow here doing my shadow nose thing. And this time I've got to just take some time, take a minute, and just talk about one person. This guy, Sam Jackson. One of my all-time favorite actors, man. I'm telling you, this guy, you put him in a movie, it's gold. You talk about snakes on a plane. You talking about Pulp Fiction. You talking about the legendary Samuel Jackson. And I will say this. He's done it all. He's done the things to really, like, uplift and boost up a movie or TV series or whatever. And when you think about these iconic moments that he's had in Pulp Fiction. I want you to go in that bag find my wallet. Which one is it? It's the one that says bad mother... And snakes on a plane. Enough is enough! I have had it with these monkey fighting snakes on this Monday to Friday plane! Everybody strap in! I'm about to open some freaking windows. And ask you just this one question. What happened on the Nick Fury series. I'm telling you guys, like, I'm literally just like, mind blown by the fact that this series was horrible, wretched, terrible. And I'm showing you some fantastic action figures <coughs> from Star Wars to the Nick Fury itself. I had to put a little customized jacket on my man Nick Fury and stuff, my man Sam Jackson and stuff, cause I love him. But I did not love the Nick Fury series. Now, you get to episode one and you're saying, okay, what's going on? We'll establish the scrolls, the invasion, and all that other kind of stuff. And then you get to episode two and you say, okay, they're moving the story into something, something that's happening. Is it going to be exciting? Is it going to be new? Is it going to be fresh? Are they going to introduce some, like, cool characters? Are they going to bring in some guys that's going to just, like, help Nick Fury take down the bad, evil Super Scrolls? No, no, no. Not doing it. They pulled Khaleesi from uh, Games of Throne, and they said, come on, you're going to be green, and you're going to be the Super Scroll. Now, here is, uh, I got to say, um, wasn't impressed. Went impressed with the series. When I got to episode 5, I realized that this is what it is. This is going to be. Marvel's going to do what they're going to do. But the worst series I've ever seen is She-Hulk. Worst series ever. It was a snide to every single fan that exists. That loves Marvel. They said, we're going to give you exactly what we want to give you. And you're going to like it. And you're going to accept it. And you're going to be quiet. Well, the same thing they did for Nick Fury. Sam Jackson could not save this series. And I'm just saying, I'm not blaming Sam Jackson because he's one of my favorite. Look at these fantastic action figures. But I will say this. If you haven't finished the series, stop at episode 5 and just accept the fact that it's a bad series. But if you watch episode 6, you will say to yourself, what the F is going on? And then you will say to yourself, I shouldn't have watched it. Because at least I could just say it was a bad series. But when you get to episode 6, you come to the conclusion that it's like, this is horrible. This is on the level of She-Hulk series. This was trash. No knock on Sam Jackson. No knock on my man Don Cheeto or anything and stuff. They actually really didn't set anything major up. They didn't introduce any characters. They did not do anything other than introduce Khaleesi as a scroll, a super scroll. So now the super scroll she killed, so she's the female super scroll. I don't understand it. I don't get it. I'm talking about the classic Marvel stuff. So all I can say to you fans is, is that if you like Sam Jackson, you were saying? Keep collecting his action figures. I mean, come on, when do when is when is start the big the biggest point is gonna be when my man John Favreau introduces him into the Star Wars series. Rebring or reintroduce his character. That's what's up. This character, the Nick Fury, this is the cool Nick Fury that I have. You go ahead and let that one take a nap, retire, do what he's gonna do. But this one here, go ahead and bring him back. 
That's what we're waiting for. That's what we're hoping for. John Favreau, let's go. Star Wars. Asuka, I'm waiting for it. I got to find me a Asuka action figure. If anyone has them or has like a custom one or whatever and stuff, holla at the Shadow because Shadow knew and Shadow knows.